I'm Invalid Ghost, and today we're going to be playing some more Fire Emblem Awakening. We are on chapter 5 now, for, for real this time. <laughs> and, uh, Anna moved. One of the Annas moved over here. Oh my god, she's got blessed lances. Blessed lances. Blessed lances. I want it, but I have no money. I have no money. Oh, uh, oh, it hurts. Oh, it hurts so much. You know what, let's see if we can actually even do anything here. I doubt I can. Do I have it? Aww. What if I bought them? Oh, wait. Can I- could I even buy them? <laughs> Is that an option? <laughs> no, I darn. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I do have some of the DLC on my DS, but... You know, obviously this isn't my DS. <laughs> oh well, whatever. Also, this, like, map music here, it reminds me a lot of Oblivion. Does any- is anyone else getting, like, Oblivion vibes from this map? Doesn't that just sound like Oblivion? It sounds like a song you'd hear in Oblivion. It's real nice. Anyway, let's, uh, let's begin chapter 5. Chapter 5, The Exalt and the King. I forgot where we were going. Oh, we're going to Gangrel, right, right. Emeryn's going to offer parley, or whatever. What's this? I strained my throat by doing a demonic voice in Digimon. <laughs> I should have known better than to try that voice right after having healed my, from my sore throat. <laughs> Hadn't done that voice in a long time, too. Uh, I don't think I did it properly, but it's fine. It's fine. I'll just do a, I'll do a softer voice for this guy. Softer than I would have done if my voice weren't killing me. <laughs> What's this then? The exalt herself and all her radiance. I fear I must shield my eyes. <laughs> King Gangrel. I've come for the truth of this unfortunate incident between us. <laughs> the truth? I can give you the truth! Her voice was actually harder to do than that dude's voice, what the heck? Perhaps Milady might first share her name. Oh god, can I even replicate that? You may call me Aversa. <laughs> That was nowhere near close. <laughs> but that's gonna be your voice now. Very well, Aversa. Is Marybell unharmed? Who? Oh, yes. The little blonde brat. She is unharmed. <laughs> there she is. She's being kept. She's being tied up. <laughs> Unhand me, you cutterborn. Troglodyte! <laughs> Marybell! Lissa, darling, is that you? This girl crossed the Pelagian border without our consent. And what's more, she wounded the brave Pelagian soldiers who sought only to escort her safely home. <laughs> no. Lies! You speak nothing but lies, hag! <laughs> Did they not teach the meaning of the word truth in wretched crone school? <laughs> you see, no manners at all. Such a nasty little bird simply had to be caged. Whatever you say. <laughs> Such a violent temper speaks to her guilt. This will call for a weighty punishment. And if she were to later confess to being a Ulyssian spy, an Ulyssian spy, my goodness! What are you, my fifth grade teacher? She used to say that all the time. She was kind of senile. <laughs> a little crazy. I didn't really like her that much. <laughs> it would take an act of considerable good faith to repair our relations. <laughs> I have done nothing wrong! What the heck was that? <laughs> Did that sound come out of me? <laughs> sound like a dying dog, what the heck? <laughs> I have done nothing wrong! It is they who should confess! That better have been my chair, not me. <laughs> they are the ones who invaded Ulyss. They raised an entire village. 
When I attempted to intervene, they took me and dragged me across the border. Let the plundered shops and charred homes of that village serve as my proof. That would only prove Yalis has a bandit problem. Something I hear oft of late. But indeed, tonight I shall weep salty tears into my pillow for your dead villagers. Your Grace, please. Peace, Mirabel. I believe you. King Gangrel, I request that you release this woman at once. Surely you and I can sort out these affairs without the need for hostages. Without so much as an apology, why should I even bother with Parley? I'm within my rights to have her head this instant and be home in time for supper. <laughs> you black-hearted devil! I've already forgotten Crom's voice. <laughs> Control your dog, my dear, before he gets someone hurt. <sighs> now then, your graceliness. Perhaps we can arrange a trade. You give me the fire emblem, and I return Mary Contrary here in one piece. Is it Mary Bell, not Mari Bell? Frick. <laughs> not the fire emblem. You would ask for Ulysses' royal treasure? But why? Why do you think, Emeryn? Why do you think it's a royal treasure? Don't freaking give it to him. Because I know the legend. Why would he tell her that? <laughs> she doesn't seem to know what the legend is, so, you know, he had the advantage there. Is he gonna tell us now? <laughs> oh, the legend of the Fire Emblem. <laughs> he is. He is. Okay. That's not what you should do if you want it. You should have told her that it was worthless garbage. <laughs> I want it because it's pretty and it'll look nice on my mantle. <laughs> but no, instead you have to go, The Fire Emblem is the key to having all one's wishes realized. I have desired it for years. Years. Yet my birthday comes and goes each year and nothing from you, Liz. <laughs> The emblem's power is meant for a single purpose, King Gangrel. To save the world and its people at their hour of most desperate need. Would you claim a more noble wish? <laughs> <laughs> I want what every Pelagian wants. A grisly inn for every last Elysian. What could be more noble than that? What? <laughs> Don't act so surprised, Emerin. <laughs> Surely you have not forgotten what the last exalt did to my people. Your father named us heathens. Well, our father was right. You guys are heathens. <laughs> His crusade across Pelagia butchered countless of my subjects and my kin. I have never denied Ulysses' past wrongdoings. But I have sworn to never repeat those mistakes. Ours is now a realm of peace. You're an eyesore. You're an eyesore. God, I wish my vocal cords were in better shape. <laughs> Yours is now a haven of hypocrisy. Now give me the fire emblem. No, no your grace. I'd sooner die than act as a bargaining chip for this filthy reprobate. Repro reprobate. <laughs> no, Maribel. Mary Bell, Mary Bell, Mary Bell's right. Ugh. Talk, 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 talk. It's time to speak louder than words. This negotiation is over, your luminosity. I shall have the fire emblem if I have to pry it from your shiny dead hands. Rude. Are, are we gonna fight? Fight, 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 fight! It's a good thing Crom came. Ooh. Dead. He must have got a crit. Think again. Stay back, or you all suffer the same fate. Oh. Now that's a declaration of war, if I've ever heard one. A big, messy war that will bleed you Ulyssians dry. <laughs> really now? Poor, stupid girl. Are you really worth fighting a war over? 
Years from now you'll be remembered only as she who destroyed House Ulysses. No. No, that's not... Oh, Lissa, please, no! Ooh. I don't know what the frick just happened. Oh, a Rickin! A Rickin! <laughs> the freaking ten-year-old came to save us all! Yay, Rickin! Exclamation mark and question mark, but in the other order? Frick. <laughs> Maribel, go! You're free! Rickin, what are you doing here? Just run, we can talk about it later. Oh, is this your little boyfriend? Isn't he just precious? Don't talk down to me. <laughs> Don't talk down to me, witch. <laughs> yeah, use that wind. Use that wind magic. <sighs> wind magic. We fight together. Come on, Maribel. Yes. Right. Woo! <laughs> Wretched whelp. I should... No. Our soldiers have them outnumbered. The brats will be dead long before they can reach their comrades. Now, you should have went after them, because uh, now they're going to be on my side, and that means they're going to be very useful to me, and not to you. Because they're not going to be dead. I don't know where that sentence was going. Okay, uh, let's see what the... <laughs> Let's see what the map looks like. Lots of axes, as usual. We got a mage. He knows Flux. Of course he knows Flux. Why wouldn't he know Flux? I love Flux. I wanted Flux. We got some more mages, some axes, some sword, mage, axe sword. Ooh, that's a big sword guy. Ooh, do not like. That'll be painful. Ooh, more of them. A lot of myrmidons. Don't like myrmidons. Alright. Barbarians, and sword people, and mages, and oh god. Ooh. Do not like these guys. We're gonna need Verizon Mobile. Ooh, he is a bullion! He is a bullion! I gotta kill Orton. <laughs> well, he is the king boss dude, so of course I gotta kill him. But whatever, I need to kill him. I need money. <laughs> I'm so poor. We are so poor as dirt. We need an archer. We also need... I don't know. I mean, everyone else is pretty good. We just need an archer. So someone needs to go so we can have an archer. Alright, so who do we get rid of? We have Lonk. Uh, I like Lonk, but do I want to waste Lonk? I mean, he's got a killing edge. And a killing edge is really good. You need a different sword, dude. Here, take a bronze sword as well. Just so I don't have to waste the killing edge uh, every single turn. Because killing edge... Killing edge has a high critical rate. I love that sword. It's great. Do I need Lissa? Yes, most likely. There are a lot of enemy units on the field. We are going to need a healer. Do I need Muriel? I do want her to level up. Do I need both Style and Sully? Probably not. Do I need Vake? I don't think I saw a single axe, I mean, lance user on the field. Vake is very powerful, but there's a lot of swords, guys. And he would not be good against that. But then again, he is so strong. I don't think we need Vake. We're gonna bring Verizon Mobile instead. We can always train them later, I suppose. We'll need money for it, but we can try and train them later. Alright, and also, Verizon Mobile, I do have a sword for you. Muriel picked it up. Here, take this. You can't use it yet, but maybe in the future. Okay, alright. We're good, we're good, we're good. Let's save again. And let's fight. Okay, we get two extra people. We got Mary, Mary Bell and Rickon on the right side. Wahaha, I have my war. Captain Orton, remain here and take down as many Ulyssians as you can. You can expect reinforcements from the forts as well. Now do your best at doing your worst. Wahaha. 
Okay, bye, very evil man. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, how do I do the thing? There we go. Okay, alright. So, hmm. I need to know the specific whereabouts and range. I need to know the specific range on these six. Yes. Ooh, and there's a, there's still red over here. Can't be coming from them, no. So they're gonna get attacked by a... Ooh. This is good against flying? That's good. So wind is good against flying creatures, so they should be okay. And she's another healer. That's not good for her. <laughs> okay. Oof. What do we do? 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 Okay, we need to team up. Who's the best fit for everyone? Uh, and I don't want... <clears throat> Who should team up with Frederick first? I think Sully, maybe? Maybe no one. No one should team up with Frederick. Yeah, Frederick should be on his own. Just do it, Freddy. I trust you. He's fine. He's fine. He's Frederick. He'll be fine. Alright, Cleo, go and assist him. Dang, Cleo. You're out for blood. Okay, use Thunder. Finish him off. Come on. <laughs> I did want to attack the sword guy, but whatever. It's fine. It's all fine. I'm just glad one dude is down. That's one less thing to worry about. That's coming Rickon's way. Rickon and Marybelle's way. Alright, um... You three should probably go after these axe guys. Okay, so he adds a skill, speed, and luck to everybody. And she adds two strength, skill, speed, and defense to everybody. Mm, strength plus three. That's really good. Okay. You only added strength plus two. Alright. You two team up. Now which one of you should team up with Krom? He doesn't need magic. What if he teams up with you? Yeah, you don't need any of that. <laughs> you should team up with him. Gives him a decent buff anyway. Alright, does that mean you two should be to te should team up? Magic and skill. Well, the skill could be useful. Strength, skill, and defense. You don't really need that, either. I guess skill is the most useful thing you got going. What if, uh, Lissa teams up? That's not bad, that's not bad. I think she should go and team up with Muriel. Because that would just be good. I think you should definitely wait here at the edge of the badness. And same with you. Wait at the edge of the badness. Because you're a mage. Does 8 damage. I'm just gonna let the enemies come to us. Hopefully we don't die. Hopefully we don't freaking die. We'll be fine. Quick and dirty. <laughs> okay. Oh no. Only 8 damage. Okay. We can live it. We can live it. Ah, we missed. You missed. <laughs> and he's going after Frederick. You might get- Oh, no damage. <laughs> and you're dead. Cleo finished you off. Nice. 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 I think also when they gain support with each other, more support with each other, they work better together. You know, they gain more buffs, and I think the chance of them protecting each other and fighting for each other is raised a little bit. I'm not sure about that, though. But I do know they get better buffs. Okay, that's not good. Come on, dude. Shh, kill him. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's so dangerous. Okay, alright. I should have done something with Rick and, and the other. And Maribel. Ooh, because they're not doing so good. Ooh. Okay. Frederick, you need to go. You need to go, <laughs> is what you need. <laughs> I don't even know what to do. Alright, this should kill. Just do it. I'm so scared. 
I do not want Rika to die because I'm. I don't know if he's, he counts as having has having joined us yet. I think he might need to survive to join us, but I'm not sure. And because of that, I'm terrified. Okay, um, just gotta, ooh, ooh, just gotta make a little safe state here. You know, you never know. You might, you might need that. Okay, that's cool. Please, please get away. <laughs> okay, um. I'm gonna have him hide here, and I'm gonna have you use a staff on him. Mend is a really good uh, healing staff. It's basically just a better version of heal. It's great. There you go. Okay. Maybe you should be here. Yeah, I don't trust. I don't trust anything. I don't trust this. I don't trust anything. Nothing at all. Okay, you need to fight. Just to get some experience, that'd be nice. Lonk has a 26% chance of fighting and a 3% chance of defending. <laughs> okay, cool. Whatever, let's just attack this guy. Come on, Lonk, we can do it. Okay, Lonk didn't want to join in. That's fine, that's fine. You didn't have to join in, Lonk. You didn't have to. Alright, let's fight this dude. Not good. I might have screwed ourselves. I might have screwed ourselves. I might have just screwed ourselves. Well, Mario got to level up, <laughs> but it doesn't matter because I'm pretty sure Krom's gonna die in the next turn. Because I'm kind of stupid. I'm kind of stupid. I'm kind of a terrible tactician. I should not be in charge of anything. Ooh. That's nice. Not nice. Okay, killing Edget is. We need to get rid of these people as fast as possible. Thank you, Lonk. Dead. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> Too bad none of it matters, because I'm pretty sure. He's gonna die. Ooh, he's only got a 49% chance to hit Krom. Well, we just got a, we just got a low backup. <laughs> okay, we're gonna be fine. We're all gonna be fine. Everything is gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Ooh, yes, Krom joined in. Oh, thank you, Krom, for joining in. Oh, Krom, you don't know how much you just saved our butts. You just saved our butts so much, Krom. Krom, you saved our butts. Krom, you saved our butts. You saved us so much, Krom. Krom, you saved us. You're the best. If she does nine, then what do you do? You can kill. You can kill if she does nine. Okay. Great, we can do it. We can do it. Kill it. Get her, Mariel. Or him. Or whatever. <laughs> Get it, Mariel. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Whatever, you leveled up. You're fine, you're fine. Da -da 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 -da. You're level 3, finally. Propitious growth, if I may say so. Good for you. Weapon level D. Okay, nice, 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 nice. You kill now with the falcon. Falchion. Kill it. And dead. Thank you, Soli, for stepping in. Yes, you do. Oh, okay. All right. All right, that's how we do it. That's how we do things. I can feel a huge difference. Good for you, Krom. Okay, we're saved. We're saved. We're saved. We're saved. We're saved. We're saved. All right, you maybe. Mm, there's so much. There's so much wrong with this. All of this is wrong. I should have made the move in the previous turn, but I didn't because I'm a dingus. I don't know. I worried about their health and safety, but Cleo and Frederick were better than I expected, and ugh. Man, it's just, it's just all terrible. We just gotta hope Cleo lives. We just gotta hope Cleo lives. 
jeez. Uh, I should have saved or something before doing that, but whatever. Bye bye, Mirabelle. Let's hope you're still in our army after this. <laughs> Yeah, they're brutes. They're pretty bad. Please tell me you're okay. Please tell me you're all fine. What a horrible mess I made of this. Time to go powder my nose. Okay, she's fine. She's good. <laughs> she's fine. <laughs> she's just going to go powder her nose. <laughs> Please don't die, Cleo. Oh my god, that only did one damage. Is it because you're in a fort or is it because you're actually good? <laughs> At everything. Holy freak, you, you level up again. Oh my god, she never stops leveling up. She just keeps on going, man. She's at level 10. I can tell I've gotten stronger. Yeah, I can tell too. Solidarity? What does that do? Uh, I would assume it means she's better off alone. <laughs> ah, dang. That one did 5 damage. Oh well. He's gonna die. He's going to die. Come on. Let's get him. Holy frick. <laughs> The game did not like that double thunder. <laughs> hey, look at this. Oh, he's going after Frederick. Why do you have to go after Frederick? Come on. If you had gone after Cleo, they could have defeated you. <gasps> Rick it, please. Rick and 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 I don't think Rick and gonna make it. Come on, Rick and come on, Rick and come on, Rick and just dodge. Ah, oh, crud is right. It's a good thing we're on classic. I mean, not classic. Casual. <laughs> Can't fight in this state. No choice but to pull back. <laughs> oh well, you know you served your purpose. Oh jeez, they're all coming. <laughs> oh no, I didn't. I didn't expect the boss to start moving. I won't ask for your name. Only your life. That's rude. My name's Cleo, by the way. Anyway, I'm going to kill you now. <laughs> Ah, uh, almost. She almost did it. Ooh, 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 there's so many dragons. So many dragons. So many dragons. There's so many dragons. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Uh, here, get that guy. He's, he'll die. He'll die. Get him, Verizon. Get him, Verizon Mobile. Oh, good job. Good job. My favorite archer. My own, also my only archer, but my favorite archer. I don't want to move these two at all. <laughs> okay, it's fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Why don't you attack the dragons? Attack this dragon first with Wilderwind? Yeah? Oh, but you only have two more. Okay. Katarina's Bolt? Ah, look at that. That's some nice damage. Alright, that's good. That's good, I think. Shall we? I don't know, shall we? This is scary. Yes. See, I would take down the boss, but I'm afraid that once I take down the boss, the battle's over, and I kind of want the experience for more, more people, you know? Mm. Wow, everything kills this guy. <laughs> this guy's a pushover. <laughs> Alright. Well, he'll, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Ouch. Frederick, you're gonna be fine. Frederick, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine, Frederick. Please tell me you're gonna be fine. Okay, you. Go after that dude. He is so totally gonna die the next turn. <laughs> Get him. Rick and didn't die. You two need to come up here and switch. You two need to go up to take a Volinary. Oh, great. There's enemy reinforcements. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. I should have sat in the forts. Oh, well, it's fine. Mm, it's not fine. Muriel's dead. Inconceivable. Okay, maybe we should take out that boss by now. Yeah, 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 get out of here. Get out of here, Muriel. Get out of here. You did good. You did Oh. You didn't want to go after Cleo, because he saw my heel. Oh. 
wow, she can float in midair. <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, it's fine, it's fine, it's, uh, it's fine. It's fine. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We haven't lost. We haven't lost yet. It's not all, not all is hopeless. Just because everybody's going after this poor archer who doesn't deserve this, doesn't mean it's all hopeless. Yeah, he did. <sighs> it would be tawdry to fight on like this. Instead, I shall make a dignified exit. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh, this is not going well. Oh, but you can't do anything. Haha, -ha, only one damage. Ha, ah, you're dead. Cleo's having the time for life. <laughs> Everyone else is dying. <laughs> But Cleo is having the time for life. <laughs> Yay! That he missed. Yes! Good him stop. Yes! Good job! Good job, Stow! That was amazing. That was amazing, Stow. You deserve that XP. Good job. Amazing job. We are so screwed. So screwed. Let's just attack this guy. Frederick does not look ready. Frederick- Ooh. Did he say farewell? Holy frick! His sword is glowing like a lightsaber. Okay, well he's dead. Never mind, Frederick, you look good. <laughs> You're doing good, Frederick. <laughs> Keep up the nice work. <laughs> Holy frick. Heard me talking bad about him. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. I'm so scared. Oh, I'm so scared. But the falcon, the falchion, I mean, I keep calling it the falcon. The falchion does good damage against dragons and whatnot, right? Does this count as a dragon? I'm pretty sure this counts as a dragon. So, uh, let's kill it. <laughs> there we go. There we go. He's dead. He's dead. Sully, you, you really didn't help out much at all, but, um, whatever. Whatever. It's just, just he's dead. Yay. <laughs> You really need better tools. What if we switched? Ugh, that would work. Go for it. Go for it. I may be sacrificing Locke here, but that's fine. I have no idea what he said. Ooh, good job, Lonk. Good job, Lonk. Good job. Holy frick. Holy frick, never mind. I believe in you guys. We're gonna win. See? There is no point in, in feeling sorry for ourselves. <laughs> Not yet, anyway. Hey, Freddy boy, you want a little culinary? Here, you can take it. <laughs> boy. Come on, you can take it. You can take it. You can take it. You can take it. I knew he couldn't take it, but I was hoping he'd miss. It would dodge. He would dodge. Ooh. Sorry. After a treat, for now at least. Okay. That's fine. At least you apologized. It's pretty nice of you. <laughs> oh, no, Stal. Oh, no, Stal. Come on, Stal. Show him who's boss. So close to leveling up. Oh, and they're all going after Cleo. Okay, that missed. Woo. Look at this power couple go. <laughs> yes! yes. <laughs> she's getting into it. She she likes this too much. She's enjoying this way too much. <laughs> Holy frick, that's a good level up. Now that's what I call progress. Yeah, we all know that, Cleo. Holy frick, she's leveling up way too much. <laughs> she's like at level 12. What the heck? Everyone else is like at level 4 still. Oh, frick! She ain't let anyone get touching Freddy. Ooh, <laughs> Ooh 69! <laughs> nice. Nice, Cleo. Oh my god. Wait, there's more? <laughs> what? I thought everyone was dead. I thought Cleo killed them all. No, she didn't. There's more? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, it's all gonna be fine. Frederick, sit here and take a Volinary. Okay. 
We'll be fine if we stick together. Style, you hear that? You gotta come over and stick together. Oh no. I think it's over for Style. No, wait. Get on that fort, Style. You get on that fort, and you take that Volinary, and you stand your ground. You stand your ground, Style. No, don't transfer. Just wait. Just sit there. We also need that sparkly on the ground. Oh well, whatever. Someone will get it. Oof. Come on, Style. You can do it. You can do it. You are on a fort now. You have the advantage. You have the high ground. Oh, frick. Oh, this could be a problem. Mm, it wasn't. <laughs> okay, alright, 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 alright. You know, you guys could chill out at any moment, and that'd be totally fine with me. Okay, you guys need to go over here, switch places. I really want to get that sparkly. <laughs> I just do. <sighs> We're gonna be fine. Take another Volinary. We're gonna be fine. They're gonna be fine. They are Cleo and Frederick. They're gonna be fine. There's no doubt in my mind. Okay, k take him out, Style. You stand your ground, you fight, you kill them all, Style. <laughs> Show them who's boss. Yes, get that level up. Yes, Style. Level five. Nah, I mean, well, I guess it is progress. <laughs> it's not great, but something, I guess. <laughs> oh well. Okay, who else is there? Oh, Cleo. She's fine there. She's fine. Everyone's fine. Everyone's good. Come on, Stell. I believe in you. Come on, Stell. Come on, Stell. <sighs> oh, it's so horrible. Okay, sh that person's gonna die. You're gonna die. Look at this. Amazing. Ooh, another crit. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> You didn't- you don't need to get a crit every two seconds, Cleo! I mean, it's great and all, but really, you're wearing down your weapons, and also, uh... It's unneeded. <laughs> you're already gonna attack twice. And he was already gonna die. He didn't need to die. He didn't- you didn't need to do that. That was an overkill. Alright. Come on, Style. You can take this guy. You can take this guy. He's a- he's a pushover. He's a pushover, Style. Oh, he's not a pushover. Okay, this dude's a pushover, though. He's gonna die. <laughs> you missed. You're gonna die now. Bye-bye. Nice. Did she say nice, too? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, we're all gonna be fine. I just want the effing sparkly. Alright, I just want the sparkly. And I'm gonna take it. I don't give a dang <laughs> if St Sully dies. All done polishing the weapons. Can't fight Jack Squaw without a trusty blade or bow. Okay, cool. I mean, that wasn't really that worth it. Oh. Stal, can you kill anyone here? Mm, no. Why does the sword do more damage than the lance? When the lance is supposed to be the better weapon? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, let's just kill the boss and see what happens. Frederick. Well, I can't give it to Cleo. She already has way too much... She's She already got way too much experience in this battle. So, Frederick, you take it. You take him down. You can't. Not even with... Okay. Well, seeing as you can't. <laughs> God, I've wasted... Uh, so much. Okay, we'll just use a Wilderwind. It'll take him out. And he'll die. Here we go! Okay. I didn't realize that that was only a 59% chance. Frederick, come save me. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Uh, I have put her at risk now because I moved her from the fort. That's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, use the lance. I mean, you only have a 79% chance of hitting, but it does a lot more damage. Just do it. Stake. I'm not calm at all. <laughs> oh! <laughs> she got mad again! <laughs> Holy frick. Okay. Well, he's dead. <laughs> this matters not. Soon war will be upon your soil. <laughs> 
Okay. Whatever you say. Hey! We got money, finally! Yes! Yes! We can finally sell that and get paid! Okay, so the battle didn't end, so I could have killed him a long time ago and not had to deal with so much struggling. Ah, oh, well, whatever. Is it even worth it to use a Volinari on you, Stal? I don't know. Let's see, that'll give you 18. How much is he gonna attack you for? 10. Now how much is he gonna attack you for? 11. Yeah, you're gonna die, Stal, no matter what. So you might as well go down fighting. Give it your best, Stal. Give it your best! <laughs> we'll see you later. We'll see you back at the barracks. At the barracks. Uh, okay. Well, he missed his second shot, so that means Stal got to live an extra turn. Okay, cool. But now he's going to die. Ah, <laughs> oh, poor Stal. Poor horse. Deserve he didn't deserve that. Ugh, end of the road for me. I have to withdraw. Okay, have fun. Oh boy. Okay, we're still good. Everyone's in good shape. Gray shape, even. There is a sparkly up there that I really, really want. So, let's go get it. Ooh, oh, but you went after Frederick and Cleo, so you're gonna die. <laughs> They're unstoppable. Oh, I forgot to switch out his silver lance. Now he's gonna waste it. He's gonna waste the last of it. Ah, oh, frick. Oh well, it's fine. It's all fine. It's not fine. Okay, you go over here. Attack. Use a thunder. Aw, oh, come on. You had an 83% chance. Eh, whatever. You got a chance to hit him twice, so he's fine. He's dead. You're good. You're good. Okay, I need you to go up here, and you need to switch out that lance for... Eh, sword's good. Sword is good. You can wait there. You guys just wait here. I don't trust it. I ain't risking Krom. I can risk Frederick, he's not a main character. <laughs> he can't permanently die. <laughs> Alright, get him. He's standing on the sparkly that I want. Almost. Hmm. Alright, thunder him. Dead. There. And you're level 12. And you're level 12. They're just gonna get tons of experience, aren't they? Well, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. So they're going to s f steamroll the entire game. It's fine. It's fine, man. It's fine. Uh, kill that dude. I hate Flux. Flux users can go die in heck. Dead. Nice. Aw, oh, 99. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> What'd you get? What'd you get? What'd you get? Oh. <laughs> I managed some extra training. I must stay sharp to protect my comrades. Okay, good for you. Weapon proficiency improved. Yay! Alright, you guys can go in. Mm, come on. How bad could it be? How bad could this be? You should probably give one of those to Sully. Yeah, whatever. How bad could it be? See, he's only gonna do four damage. Sully, you're not even gonna step in. How dare you? Alright, you're not gonna do a crud. You only did two damage. Two damage. She's not even wearing armor. How do you suck so bad? <laughs> you should be ashamed of yourself. Alright, this will only do 11. Which sucks. Ah, eh, use the rapier. Get a crit. Get a crit, come on. Darn. Sully didn't even step in. Again. Well, you know what, Frederick, you deserve it, because you're about to level up anyway. Get him. Dead. Nice. Nice. And you got to level five. Nice. Ooh, nice. I must admit, I've outdone myself. Yes, you have. Ah, <gasps> yes, you got Luna! Oh, you got Luna! Great skill. Cleo and Frederick, yay! 
I'm sweating on my keyboard again. <laughs> Jesus, calm down, Lissa. She's fine. <laughs> Mary Bell, are you hurt? My humble thing. Nothing I didn't return twofold, darling. Hey. I'm glad you're safe, person I barely know. Who? Oh, it's you. Yeah, I know you're not especially fond of me, but it's a relief just the same. Oh, it's not a question of fondness. I am simply protective of Lyssa. My treasure is very sensitive and... Wait, am I really justifying myself to a commoner? Cods. Yes, well, I do... Apologize for being curt and... And... And you have my thanks for your part in the rescue. There, I said it. <sighs> now, if only Frederick would apologize. For calling me a savage and an animal. <laughs> Among other things. Forgive me, Em. I acted rashly. Oh, please. She was almost cut down by that brigand. By that dude. It's alright, Crom. King Gangrel is the one at fault here. You were only protecting me. The Mad King will be rallying his forces, if they have not mobilized already. I suggest we make haste back to Yistol and discuss our strategy. Strategy. <laughs> of course, Frederick. It seems war is upon us. We must protect the Elysian people at all costs. I'm here too! <laughs> Cleo's just in the background. <laughs> I'm here too, guys! <laughs> Alright. And there's where we're going next. And ooh, we got a paralogue. Ooh, I don't know what that one is. What are you what are you selling? I have no money, but I can sell stuff. I can sell stuff. I only have a uh, this oh, that's not much money. <laughs> it's it's something. It's something alright. <laughs> eh. Oh, why did you leave me? I didn't think you would leave. Oh. Do I want a steel sword? Yes. Okay, alright, 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 alright. Give me that steel sword. Oh, uh, who wants it? Lonk. Let's give it to Lonk. Steel sword. More powerful than its iron brother. Yep. Okay, cool. Um, we also need iron tools. Iron tools would be nice, really, really nice. Can we just sell you some bronze stuff that we don't need? <laughs> Here, take this. And take this too. We don't need it. Hers as well. I'm just gonna give her iron tools as well. And Stal. Okay, give them all iron tools. And then we'll see how much money we have left. And if we have no money left, I'm gonna be real upset with myself. <laughs> Alright, take an iron lance. And take an iron axe. Uh, you need an iron lance, and I just realized you can't even use an iron sword. Okay, that's kind of pathetic. Whatever. Here you go, iron sword. I gotta give them bron la bron bronze lances again. I mean, bronze... I gotta get them bronze weapons again. I gotta get her a bronze sword and him a bronze lance. I suppose I should have checked before selling the... <sighs> it's fine. It's all fine. Look! Lonk has a bronze sword, so all we need is a bronze lance. Didn't waste anything. Nope. Definitely didn't. Okay, do anyone- does anyone else need something? You don't need anything. You don't need anything. You don't need anything. You already have an iron axe. Uh, how many uses does an iron axe have? 40 and you already at 24. I guess you could use another one. Just in case that one breaks. Mm. Do you- can you use an iron lance? No. Okay. So I'll just leave you like that. Um, can you use an iron lance? Oh, you have an iron lance already. You don't need a thing. And you don't need anything. Can we get her an L thunder? <laughs> I'd like her to have an L thunder. We'll put it in the convoy. It's pretty good. Okay, all right. That was just our little spinning spray. That was a little extra, you know? A little extra thing. What about this Anna over here? Oof, Master Seal. I don't have money for it, though. I have me. 
Is the blessed is the blessed lance really worth it at this point? I mean, the only one that can probably use it is Frederick. And he's already overpowered as it is. So does he really need it? He does he really need it? I don't think so. I think we can save our money. Some people need Volinaries, though. That's for sure. Definitely. Uh, Soli needs one. What is up here? The Twins Turf. Paralogue 2. Who are the twins? I don't know. I don't remember. How do I not know what the Twins Turf is? Well, whatever. We'll go there next, since uh, it's before the chapter. So I'll just, I'll just sit right here. And let me... Ooh, we have barracks and supports. Alright, cool. But first, I want to give Cleo some of her stuff and get rid of this hand axe. We'll give that to Vake. You know what? She doesn't even need a Volinary. I trust her. Can you, Freddy boy, can you get a new Volinary? No, because we didn't buy an extra one. Is everyone good? No, no, no. Because you need to trade with... Uh, you need to store that and give that to Sully. And Stel, do we have any bronze lances in here? No, just one that Donnie has. Okay. Can we buy a bronze lance somewhere? Maybe here? Yeah, I thought so. Alright. Buy... Stal, a bronze lance. They both need- they need to be good at both sword and lance, it's just so that they're more versatile. So that they're better, you know. Alright, now that we've done all that, we can now do some supports and barracks. <laughs> Let's do barracks first, because it's quicker. We've only got- ooh, 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 there's a heart and a friendship hand! Okay, new events have occurred. Nice. Okay, well, give me some people. Hello, Cleo. Need a break, huh? Yes, I do. <laughs> I've been playing for an hour. Do need a break. What is the boost of excellence I sense within my noble self? Even I am amazed. Ugh. We can get a surge of luck and resistance. Well, it's... Maybe we should do barracks before we do the chapter, because now this isn't gonna help us unless it stays with him until the next chapter, but what whatever. <laughs> What about you, Donald? What do you what do you have to say? I sure hope all them back home's doing all right. Yeah, me too. Something tells me they're dead. <laughs> hey, do I have something? Hey, was that bookshelf always there? I told you guys. I think I'm pretty sure like the barracks get more cluttered as time goes on. These two are getting support. All right, whatever. But I want to look. I don't remember that shiny thing over there next to the swords. I don't remember that bookshelf. But who knows, maybe I'm, I was just blind last time that I came in here. Anyway, let's listen in to these two. You look jubilant today. Have you devised a new algorithm for sorting your possessions? No, I just finally worked out how to use this difficult magic. Wanna see? And there that goes their relationship. Woo! <laughs> Alright, and who's getting some friendship? We got hands here. Who's holding hands? Ooh. Cleo and Maribel. Okay. Oh my god, Cleo's doing like the same exact motions that Frederick was doing last time. <laughs> it's ridiculous looking. <laughs> okay, alright, let's listen in. <laughs> I'm always so bored after a bit. I can't stop looking at Cleo. <laughs> Oh, it reset. What the heck happened to the camera? I guess it just changed angles. I'm always so bored after a battle. How do you pass the time? I retire to my tent and work out new strategies. Or take walks when I'm down. Sometimes to the bar. Sometimes to get some ale. I mean, fresh air, of course. Just fresh air. I like fresh air. Air's nice. Maribel and Cleo's relationship improved. Yay! Get the frick out of here. Alright, and last but not least, we have Sumia and Kalem. Alrighty. Kalem looks like he's having a nervous twitch there. Let's listen in. I know I have a ways to go, but why don't we try fighting together in the next battle? 
Of course. I'll be your invisible shield. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully you two will be in the next battle. <laughs> I never put them anywhere. Has this changed at all? Oh yeah, we should probably look at Rickon and Marybelle's, huh? Marybelle! Lisa's best friend, a proud and sharp-tongued noble from one of Ulysses' most well-to-do houses. She is cold to strangers, particularly commoners, but warms quickly, the most likely to, lo to toss in her sleep, born on April 14th. And I think that's an Aries, but I could be wrong. In fact, I probably am, because I don't pay attention to the zodi zodiac signs months that much, but I did write a story about them once when I was younger. <laughs> Which is why I care about them at all. <laughs> I find them fascinating. Anyway, Rickon. A novice shepherd who looks and acts like a child. Excuse me, no I don't. I don't act like a child. How dare you? <laughs> well, this endears him to the others. Hmm. He hates being treated as anything less than an equal. That's right. He sees Krom as a brother. The most popular with cute animals. Born on May 23rd. Don't know what the frick that is. <laughs> Taurus? I don't know. Anyway, that should be all right. Uh, oh wait, Lonk. We haven't looked at Lonks either. No, wait, we did. We did. I remember, because I called him a Scorpio, and he's not a Scorpio. Okay, cool. <laughs> Alright, let's do some support now. Krom and Sully, finally! Finally, they got their support! I'm sad that no one else got support, but that's fine, that's fine. We can work on them later. Let's finally see what Krom and Soli have to say to each other. This is gonna be weird. <laughs> hmm? Oh, hey, Soli. Hello, Krom! I don't. I still don't know what the frick voice to give Soli. I feel bad. <laughs> she doesn't have a voice. She just has whatever the heck I think of at the moment. Are you here alone? I thought you'd be with Lissa and the rest of the woman. Oof! <laughs> Why? So I can make dinner for all the brave men? Nuts to that. I'll tend the fire. That seems like a lot of hard work for one person. Would you rather I cook or sew? No thanks, I hate all that <laughs> garbage. <laughs> Great. Huh, well, I guess I, do, I, I can't speak today. I'm having a stroke. <laughs> oh, well, I guess I understand. You don't seem much like a... a Come on, Krom. You, you, don't you say it. You already said it to Cleo. <laughs> What, a lady? Go ahead, say it. No sweat off my thighs. Okay, then. I guess everyone has their own special talents. <laughs> uh, I like how Cleo got all upset when Krom was like, I don't see you as a lady. And then he says the same exact thing to Sully here. And Sully's, Sully's okay with it. <laughs> say, I can't really cook or sew either. Can I at least help with the fire? Ha, yeah. <sighs> you're alright, Krom. That was it? That was pretty short. <laughs> We're just gonna make a fire together. Okay. Seems norm like normal behavior to me. Alrighty, well. That's all we got. That's all I'm gonna do for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I know I did, because I really love this game. I love this game so much I wish I had a sequel. But it doesn't, unfortunately. But I wish it did. There's a lot of Fire Emblem games that I wish had a sequel, actually. And this is one of them. <laughs> In fact, I wish they all had sequels. <laughs> but anyway, that's gonna be it for this time, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.